She lived an enviable lifestyle complete with limousine rides and private airplane jaunts on The Bachelor earlier this year. But former contestant Sophie Tiemann swapped luxury travel for public transport as she returned to her day job in Sydney this week. The 25-year-old property valuer was back to the daily grind on Monday, catching both a ferry and a bus while going about her business. Sophie cut a stylish figure in a corporate chic ensemble consisting of a white top layered underneath a tie-up jacket and a pair of cropped black trousers. She also ditched her cocktail party high heels for sensible footwear as she was seen sauntering down the ferry ramp in a pair of black flats. However, the blonde bombshell added a touch of glamour to her rather conservative look by accessorizing with oversized sunglasses. Sophie who became one of the most talked about women in Australia after last Thursday's Bachelor finale, managed to blend in with the crowds as she boarded the vessel. The other passengers didn't seem to recognize her during the peak hour rush as they all appeared to be distracted by their smartphones. Later, the reality TV star continued her journey to work by hopping on a bus. Sophie was later seen pacing through streets towards her office, ready for another busy day in the property business. Sighting comes after Sophie reflected on her TV rejection during an appearance on Network 10 comedy show Have You Been Paying Attention? During Monday's episode, host Tom Gleisner asked her, When did you realize things weren't going well over there in New Caledonia? Sophie responded, I think it was as I was walking up to him, he wasn't really looking at me in my eyes. And yet I was like, Oh, I really would just love to turn around right now, but I can't. Nick Cummins awkwardly dumped Sophie during the Bachelor season finale, which aired last week, telling her, I am not able with all my conscience to wholeheartedly commit to you right now. Moments later, he delivered a similar breakup speech to Brittany Hockley, becoming the first Australian Bachelor to reject both finalists. The Bachelor Sophie Tiemann returns to her day job in Sydney 